I've been very lucky to, to compete at Bramham for, for several years and um, you know, I have had some, some good rides there and I've now won it six times so it is a very lucky competition for me. Uh, this year it was, it, was a, it was a stiff competition as always. Um, Ian Stark had designed a very decent track and um, you know, it was very demanding but the competition was, um, was hot and um, yeah, I didn't, didn't really expect to win. You, you never do but I hoped that Chilly Morning would go well and it was, it was fantastic to win in the end. He's come with a good reputation, a lot of promise. Um, produced by Nick Gauntlet and um, no, I hoped he'd go well at Bramham. I haven't had many runs on him so the partnership was still quite quite new um, but no, I never imagined he's going to win me a horse box so no, I, I own one, don't I? Hopefully my standards will measure up to the Equitrek but I think um, the, the lorry you know, is an immaculate truck and um, in the sport of eventing you know, we all um, we all do our best and cross every um, T and dot every I, and attention to detail is very important. So um, I'm sure it's the same in the, in the Equitrek Trek world, and you know, we'll work well together. I mean, the fantastic thing about the Equitrek is that um, you can drive the, the vehicle on a standard license. You can be 17 years um, and still be able to drive the lorry. And I think that there are very few other horse boxes that, that, that are possible for. Um, I think also. Um, Insurance-wise, yeah, um, you know, my young guys can, can drive it on, on, on their insurance and with no trouble. So, I mean, from, from the point of view of having a handy lorry that can be driven by anybody um, when days, for, for example, that I'm not here, um, it's just going to be fantastic. It's going to make my life a lot easier for sure. Um, I'm not always here and quite often we've got horses going in different directions so this could be used for going cross-country schooling or to the vets or, um, or even long trips just with one or two horses on. It's a small vehicle, very economical to run and um, will make a big difference. I mean, the great thing about the Equitrek is it, it, it's quite a quick vehicle but it's also incredibly economical. To go 35 to 40 miles a gallon to the gallon um, is unthinkable in the horse box world so it's going to make a massive dis difference economically. I mean, it's great that these um, lorries are built on, um, on new chassis, they're all, all built as one and um, it's great from the point of view of safety and um, you know, it's, it's, not, it's nice to know that they've all, everything's been built at the same time and you, you know exactly what you've got. When, when travelling in Europe, I mean, it's great to know that Equitrek have got a, um, a net network of um, European dealerships and if you were to run into trouble, there'll be someone not too far away and, and that's, that's fantastic. The payload of these vehicles is, is 1,200 kilos which means that they can take two decent sized horses and a bit of kit which is, which is all you need. So here we've got the, the low wide ramp um, which means that the, the slope for the horses on the way in is, is far less. Uh, much nicer for the horses low, particularly young stock. Um, I think some of the old lorries um, used to have half ramps and therefore it was much steeper. So here we've got a nice gentle slope. Um, here in the Equitrek the horses are actually backward facing um, which is great because it means when you put the brakes on the horses can actually lean on their backsides and support themselves rather than onto the small bar in front. So I think they're going to travel very well in that. In my opinion the Equitrek is the true choice of champions. <laughs>